Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We did it. We filled up our Jaspies World Series Special three case triple crown high end mixer featuring Topps Triple Threads Baseball, Panini National Treasures Baseball, and Topps Tribute Baseball, all three from 2019. This is a three case break. What? We've got over 110 hits possible in here as well. Man. And we've got game three is pretty exciting right here. Astros have Astros are leading 4-1 in the top of the sixth. Two outs, bases loaded. So Bregman can blow this game open and make it a series. All right. First off, an early bird special. We had a special in here too. You buy one of the first 16 spots, you can try to win another spot. A bonus, the worm. Here are the first 16 right here. Good luck. Name on top. After four times, three and a one, we'll get the worm. The bonus spot. One, two, three, and a one. Fourth and final time. Scott Curry. There's no doubt about it. Scott Curry's name was on there twice. There, there you go, Scott. You are the early bird that has caught the worm. All right, so now we'll grab everyone's names here. And now we'll do the random itself. Let's grab the teams. And let's roll it and randomize each list three and a three, six times. Six the hard way. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six times, we've got Peter down to Robert. Oh, let's go to a different tab right here for the team list. So there's Peter down to Robert. After six, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six, we got Oakland A's down to the Chicago Cubs. A's down to Cubs. All right, so Peter with the A's, and trades are allowed in this, uh, this uh, triple crown break. Uh, Giants for Mark, Brian Peoples with the Rangers, Jason Trask with the Mets, Robert. So for those of you with a little symbol next to your name, that's where you won that spot. So in six, in six Series 4, Robert won the Indians. X line six series five got the Royals. You, Brian or Josh usually buys the Royals. Brian Croft with the Angels. Javier with the Phillies. Logan from the spot from Josh. You get the Orioles. Evan with the Mariners. The X line with the X line's a nice guy. The X line with the White Sox. Levi Red Sox. Scott Curry with the Marlins. Ed with the Padres. Nice. Ron with the Braves. The X line with the Rockies. Roger with the Tigers. Rex, you have the Diamondbacks with the spot you won. Chris with the Dodgers. Matt with the Blue Jays. Scott Curry with the Astros. Aaron Kreger with the Reds. Kenton, you have the Roy uh, the Cardinals, that is. Bill, you have the Yankees. Jason with the Brew Crew. Bill with the Nationals. Bill D. Scott with your early bird spot. Twins. Anthony with the Pirates. The X-Line with the Tampa Bay Rays. And Robert, you have the Chicago Cubs. All right, now let's alphabetize by team right here. And I'm going to pause the video really quick, just for a minute or two. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. We'll be right back. Hi, welcome back, folks. So we got Nick Cam helping us out. We're starting with Tribute, then we'll do Triple Threads, then we'll do NT. There were no trades. There were no trades. So let's print out this list, and we'll get this one going. Big thanks to everybody who helped fill this up. Um... Great value in this. this. This break actually went a little bit quicker than I thought, but pretty solid. Pretty solid stuff. Now, just before we unpause the video, Nick was saying that we may run a variation of this break back tomorrow. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Or else the same one if people want. You, want the, you guys want the same one? 
It looks like sounds like we have enough cases for the same one. All right, sub Liam. So there it is, the triple crown baseball mixer. There's everyone right there. Big thanks to everybody who. I don't, it doesn't matter to me how you got into this break, whether you bought a spot straight up or whether you won a spot. Thanks for getting in. Appreciate it. They got out of bases loaded. Yeah, Fernando Rodney of all people. Oldest player in the league. Is he really? Just Forty-two years old. Wow. All right, so we're gonna start. So each of these, kind of, they're they're this way and that way. They'll all represent a pack. He's played for about twelve teams, I think. He's played for a lot of teams, like Edwin Jackson. Yeah, all cards ship in this. Francisco Lindor. So you get all the base cards. And there's a nice Clayton Kershaw, three out of ten. Almost ten. looks like eighteen would like to slash through it. Three out of ten. And that'll be for Chris Markley, who got randomized by Dodgers. Sorry, I meant 42 years young. <laughs> yeah, you've got to watch out. <laughs> Sorry. I'm just stating facts. Quick fact about I mean, like, well, uh, old, old for baseball. I didn't say that. I said he's the oldest player in baseball. 42 years young. Jamie Moyer was out there almost 50. Corey Seager, Phil Rizzuto. And Jamie Moyer was And boss. Frank Thomas autograph. Good start. 12 out of 25. Tribute to Enshrinement autograph. The big hurt. Big hit for the X line and the White Sox. See this right here? Look at that. Look how nice X line is. I know. I saw that. That's awesome. So he gets rewarded with, 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 awarded with uh, the Frank Thomas and hopefully more. There's Nolan Arenado, Nolan Ryan. And Edgar Martinez. Nice autograph here to 199. That's why we should have advertisers. We have Mariners, Evan. We have 15 years old all the way, probably. We have every age demographic. Thankfully, thankfully, Liam doesn't act like a 15 year old. <laughs> Otherwise, he would have banned a long time ago. Good kid, Liam. No, I think there's other. No, there's probably, I think some other youngsters here, yeah, too. Yeah, but there's other youngsters who email us a couple years when they grow up and be like, oh, I got banned. You know, how do I chat? I'm like, <laughs> sorry. There's Chris Sale. I guess I guess when they're older, they can try coming back. You can unban them. Unban them at 21. Yeah. If, you're still, if they're still around. and there's got a suspension, you know. Under 003 18. out of 150, stamp of approval. It's you can like go to MLB.com slash off dedication. Look up those letters and numbers. See where it's that like came Juby. from. Juvie. Red Sox, Levi. There's Mark McGuire, 99. I mean, we should do a demo. Should do a demographic survey at some point. Carlton Fisk, again out of ten, very nice, dual relic. And that is White Sox edition? Why does it doesn't say the team on the front? Isn't that weird? It's White Sox edition, but I can tell, I can tell on the, by the uniform, but no. usually it puts the team on the front. That looks like a non-logo card almost. I <laughs> know, right? That goes to the X-Line and the White Sox. Is that a song? Yeah, I think the other TV outside. Yeah, pr we won't be able to do Prism tonight, EA. Sorry. But it looks like NT is going to happen, though, because this is going to take us right until around 9 o'clock, 8.45, 9, 9 o'clock Pacific. And then we've got NT. That's one team away, and that brings us to the end of the night. I'm sure we'll do some a couple more cases tomorrow of that prism. A couple prisms a day keeps the doctor away. Didi Gregorius, autograph to 99. Yankees, that'll be for Bill Mosher on the board. With the Yankee shortstop. There's there's uh, some analytics that say Yankee Stadium is the perfect place um, for Didi Gregorius. With that, he's left handed? Yeah. That right field porch is like perfect for him. Makes sense. And like, if you look at like his spray charts, all of his homers like at Yankee Stadium. The Yankee Stadium might as well be a little league field. It's so, the fences are so short. 
All right. I think I can knock 20 homers. There's Sandy in. Koufax. The juice balls. Oh yeah, you can hit 20 at Yankee Stadium. Yeah. This guy's this guy's saying probably not. <laughs> he was overrated. Overrated. <laughs> wow. We're at 10 minutes 20 seconds in the video. Nick Jaspi. Someone marked that time. Carter Keyboom to 50. That'll be for Bill and the Nationals. I wouldn't mind pulling his autograph. Luis Severino, 45 out of 99. Made it seem like there was someone outside. All right, triple threats. Luis Severino for the Yankees. That'll be for Bill Mosher. Trying to make myself a little room here so Nick can stack up triple threads on the side. Everyone should be able to see the camera right where my hand is waving above my head. So he's going to stack all the triple threads right here. And this was a loose interface. I put that in the description. So. They just sent it to us loose. And they was like, here you yeah, go. Yeah, no idea what. He's, well, that's, they were like, hey, I can't get you a full one, but I can get you gotcha. a, this one. Nice one, so Soto. What's up, Evan? You know what I'll use it for? A triple crown, three case spray. It's a good call. Like, okay. <laughs> <They're>, did they? <laughs> <laughs> Charlie Blackman for the Rockies. X line with the Rock. I can just imagine you telling telling our rep. Like, you know what I'm going to use it for? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to use it for a triple crown break on jazbeescasebreaks.com. People will get fired up, and he's like, cool. <laughs> and he's like, all right, I don't really need to know that. Yeah, it's like you can, so you're buying it though, right? <laughs> yeah. As long as your cash checks. Yeah, check you're, you're buying it, right? It's like, yeah. Oh, okay. All right, talk to you tomorrow. Talk to you tomorrow, <laughs> Joey Votto, Billy Hamilton. All right, we'll we'll get that Josh Jacobs tomorrow. EA, we'll get that Raider Joe Mojo manana. Have a good night, man. Joey Votto, Billy Hamilton, both Reds editions going to Aaron Kreger. Severino, Aaron Nola. Not a great detail on the back there. And Anthony Rizzo triple relic to one fifty Cubbies. That'll be for Robert Myhill, who won his spot. Think Nationals come back? Mm -hmm. Well, it's only three runs down. You know, it's still a lot of, still a lot of baseball. Still a lot of baseball left. Aaron Nola to 50. <laughs> NT just sold out. Nice. I feel like the weak part of Houston is kind of their middle reliever, maybe. 90 out of 99, Freddie Freeman. I mean, they're using Brad Peacock, yeah. so I guess that's not. But They're trying to get to Osuna at some point. But yeah, but yeah that this is the soft part. There's nice Freddie Freeman to 99 for the Bravos. I've just been rooting for one of those games like last year. Ron like Shepard. 16 innings. I'd oh, love, two, two years ago, you mean, with the Dodgers? Yeah. I watch every because minute of that break, or of that, uh, that break, game. of that game. And then I feel like they, the Astros-Dodgers had that one crazy game in Houston. Wasn't it like 14 That was the 15 inning game. Yeah, yeah. That no, was but like... then Boston had an uh, extra inning game. Oh, we did have a late one again so last year, two, too. Two years in a row. So I was, I've been hoping that for that because I see like East Coast is like 3 a.m. I'm like, ah, yeah, it's kind of <laughs> brutal. <laughs> Matt Carpenter, Joe Morgan. Ooh, see, we were waiting for that. Rex, Rex is saying, hey, I'm surprised museums back not not back on the site. We were waiting for people to get thirsty for museum, and then bang, we'll order some museum put on the site. There's Justice Sheffield, a 199 Yankees edition on the Mariners now. That'll go to. Bill Mosher. So far, so good for the Yankees. Justin Verlander. Going to the Astros. That's Astros edition of Justin Verlander. And Mike Piazza. And Carlos Correa. Seven out of 50. Relic and the hologram sticker, so you know exactly what game that comes from if, that, if you look that up. You can probably look up the, the box score, too, and see what Carlos Correa did that day. That'll be for Scott Curry. Yeah, we will probably bring some museum back at some point, right? We'll probably get a good price on that. Or the same price, at the very least. People love the museum. There's Eloy Jimenez Autograph. Nice rookie auto, 39 out of 75. White Sox for the X-Line. There you go, Josh. I think he should have a great season next year. 
Yeah, it was 18 innings. That's right. That was a wild game. It was all because of Ian Kinsler. He did. He had an error for the Red Sox. I think I watched every minute of that. Alex Rodriguez, 97 out of 99. I remember you were like, "Should I go home?" Because you were breaking. Right. That's like, right. It was like it got to like midnight, and you're like. At this point, I might as well stay. And then he kept staying. <laughs> You're right, kept right. Going. I couldn't leave. Yeah, because I thought the game was going to be over right there. And then he just said, screw it. I'm going home. <laughs> and there was still like another hour of the game. <laughs> yeah. I didn't go to bed until like, yeah. But yeah, you listened to it the whole radio. And then yep. you probably stayed at your house for yep. an hour. And then finally ended. That I remember crazy. that. Yep, I, that we were breaking. And then I was like, well, I'm not doing any breaks. But if you want to hang out with me and watch the game, you can't. <laughs> but like, like shut down the shop. Nice Austin Meadows for the Rays. The X line. That's with the spot that he won. And I couldn't even tell you who won that game. And you're trying to find like tedious things to do, like top loading. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. I was like, should I sort out this prism break that we have here? There's Michael Kobeck. Like, distract yourself. The Red Sox won that one. Like, oh, that's I'm right. Almost positive. I just know the Dodgers lost the World Series. So that's yeah. all that. <laughs> Two years in a row. That's all I remember. Brutal. And I'm then these guys. Out, who, who like support beating of women Astros Gary Sanchez to 150 imagine how pissed Verlander is Verlander is like super a big advocate oh. for like he very active about that sort of oh, stuff about yeah about they domestic say, violence when they signed him they knew you know right right but, but, but like the, when the GM does stuff yeah. like that there's Miles Mikolas to 199. Cardinals. <laughs> That's right, Bill. Um, that Mikolas for Kenton. Right, Kate, I'm just not pleased about that. Correa and Bregman. <laughs> right. There's Ronald Acuna Jr. to 150. Nice. That is for Ron Shepard and the Braves. Sure they do, Rex. You've got your hope you're hoping for Randy Johnson's out of here. I think he's a diamondback in tribute. Um Diamondbacks definitely have stuff in NT and triple threats. Luis Gonzalez. Kettle Marte might be hidden near somewhere. There's Chris Bryant to 150, Robert. I mean, I can't tell you they have as much as the Yankees or something. Right. But they, they've got some stuff. I think Randy Johnson would be a cool one. Diamondbacks Randy Johnson. It's Andy Pettit to 170. That's Astros edition of Andy Pettit. That goes to... Maybe in this triple threads we hit like a Deca. Scott Curry. And Ooh, there the you go. Are one of the teams. <laughs> Imagine if we hit a Deca book. You have the Diamondbacks, Rex, and yeah, the Goldschmidt relic is the one that gets you the, the Deca like, book. Uh, Randy Johnson. Eddie Matthews. You know, how, uh, you know the, our, our customer Aaron Pettit. Yeah. You know how many times I've called him Andy Pettit? Andy Pettit. Like ninety percent of the time. <laughs> you can't do that. I try, I'm trying to. I know. I'm trying not to. But I see Pettit. I'm just like, oh yeah, Andy. I mean, Aaron Pettit. Lots of steroids. Gregory Polanco, Josh Bell to 99. Andy Pettit, that is. We got Yvonne Rodriguez and Jackie Robinson. And Bryce Harper, triple relic. This is still uh, Nationals edition of Bryce Harper to 99. That will be for Bill D. Dravohan with that one. Jin, I think, Travogen. Willie Stargell, Bryce Harper, Nationals. Luis Urias to 435 for the Padres. And Jonathan Loisaga for the. Ah, oh, Jonathan. <laughs> Goes right here. Come on. Come on. Did he do all 50 of them like this? Nine out of fifty for the Yankees. Bill Mosher. <laughs> it is kind of funny, Rex. I have noticed that it's like some sort of, some sort of like hobby, hobby god curse or something like that. 
So he's saying he doesn't get hits either way. <laughs> right. <laughs> but it's just cruel because they'll, yeah. they'll like they'll have him win a spot, the hobby yeah. gods. I guess it's yeah, it's better than buying a false spot, I guess. No, it is. Except for that one person. There's Goose the right here. Injury. We gave away spots. That that's still time. that still blows my mind. What would the logic be behind that? That's know. that's what I like if you have a point like I'm like all right, it's like that's not how we do it, but I see your point. Yeah. I could at least sympathize with the other side, but I don't get it. but I don't I don't get it. So we got an email a while ago, and someone, the gist of the email was we're giving away too many spots, like via like a translucent or whatever it was or an eight by ten that we were giving away too many spots that could have been purchased straight up, but I don't think that person was intending to buy the teams straight up. So I don't know what his point was. What do you think the point was, folks? I'm very confused. There's Smoltzy, 61 out of 99. I'm listening to him right now. Ron Shepard with the Braves. Sup, Brian O. But yeah, that was the gist of the email. It's like you're just giving away too many spots. Maybe he thought that we were like trying to over-profit on the 8x10 or something like that? No, I think... He was mad but, at the odds change for him, even though they don't. Oh, that's if that's the point. The odds never change. Out of one fifty, there's Steve Carlton. Brian O can buy ten spots in this mixer, and if you were only intending to buy one spot, that would never change the odds for you. I mean, unless you're just jealous that Brian O. That's what it is. Unless you're just jealous that someone bought ten spots. I don't know. I don't know. It's I, I, I just I still don't. But but at the end of the day, it was you're. I'm not happy that you're giving away too many so many spots. Give away too much break credit. Give away too much break credit. See that that person was trying to ruin it for everybody. Thirty one out of ninety nine. Corbin Burns, Brewers. Jason Trask. Oh, maybe he was saying it would no, sell out. No, it wasn't that because it, was, it he emailed after, after it broke and said. You know, you give away too much spots in this break, it like messed up my odds. I don't, I don't think it was a, a sellout faster straight up situation. I don't think it was that. It was definitely. Which I don't agree with that either. Like impeccable today. That's. Right. That one was sold out today. If, if it didn't do the number blocks, right. Eddie Murray tonight. I don't know. We'll, we'll have to dig up the email again. Cross out, like, redact the names. If you're in this break, sorry. I mean, I hope you understand our po process now. Uh, out of 170, Andrew McCutcheon, Giants edition. I don't know. We're, no, shoot. Now it's another email. Mark K with the Giants. All right. Last tribute, then triple threads, then you see the NT right here. I could see that. Maybe he was mad that someone got better hits on the cheaper spot. Yeah, I, I mean, okay. I could see that. Then, I mean, I don't know. Not everyone has two hundred dollars to get into a break. <laughs> we want to try to get everyone involved. I know. If we don't do it, they're like, "Oh, no, I can't afford that." Right. Any any new guy discounts? Starling Marte for the Pirates. That goes to Anthony P. All right. Uh oh, X line. What happened? Did it was kid eating crayons? Bob Gibson. Cardinals. That'll go to Kenton. Yeah, I guess not. I don't know. Tide pods. This is X line's kids eating Tide pods. Joe Morgan to fifty. Well, I hope he feels better. There's Ioannis Cespedes, triple relic to 50. Wait, don't we have an... Is that same same son with the important baseball game? <laughs> Josh Exline, we can't have that. Cespedes goes to the Mets. Is he going to be back next year? That's Jason Trask. We got a redemption right here. Oh, 
crafted, more made from scratch. And more is what you get with crunchy chicken taquitos. One of five new $5 fire grill Springer Eddie Murray. I don't know who. I think this is probably me. I use it the most. It's most likely me. Who cut the mat, Rex. There is Chris Sale, Craig Kimbrell to 150. Dual relic for the Red Sox. Levi with that one. There's Eddie Rosario and Jose Ramirez. And Austin Meadows, 10 out of 25. Nice. Wait, Brian O, do you want a, you want a sticker? Didn't we, you, you should have gotten a sticker by now. All right, so there's Austin Meadows for the Rays. And that's for Josh Xline. Nice Austin Meadows. He had a nice season this year. And the redemption is tribute autograph of... Oh, I know who that is. Not too many ball players whose names start with X. Xander Bogarts, Red Sox. That goes to Levi Johnson. So let me put this tribute away and get the uh, get the other one going. Oh, I see what you're saying, Brian. That guy's been banhammered. All right. No, it didn't. either way, it does not matter. All right, triple threads now. Andres Galarraga to 25. Strasburg to 199. Conforto to 99. And Yelich to 259. All of these will be sleeved, top loaded, and shipped. And these base cards will ship too. All right, behind Conforto is a Ranger, RBI, Nomar Mazzara, to 27. Yeah, Triple Threats has been awesome, Brian. Big fan of this stuff here. And then behind Conforto is Miguel Andujar, 72 out of 99. Bill Mosher with the Yankees. Got a spot, or got the Yankees from a spot he bought straight up. Behind Pedro Martinez is Scott Kingery, triple relic and autograph, five out of 99. Javier with the Phillies. And then we got some Red Sox, Levi Johnson, Chris Sale, 27. A lot of Red Sox this year, I feel like, for top stuff. All right, Aaron Gordon, 259, Pedro to 299, Kershaw to 299, and Acuna to 50. Piazza Story, Gordon, and Williams. And behind Yount is Corey Kluber, 1 out of 10. Helping himself. How is he helping himself? He's an AL guy. He doesn't hit. Oh! It's defense. That goes to Robert and the Tribe. Uh, I like all the, the cutout word relics. That's always been like the quirky thing about Triple Threads that I enjoy. 2 out of 27 Cole Hamels. Why doesn't Mookie sign? That's usually a player decision. You know what I mean? It's not like it's not as if Tops hasn't asked. You know what I mean? It's a player like Mookie Betts, AL MVP, they're definitely asking him. 
But at his level, you know, at his stage of his career, he could be like, eh. <laughs> I don't feel like doing it. 27 out of 27, triple relic. Carpenter, Paul DeYoung, Jose Martinez. Triple relic for Kenton and the Cardinals. We've got Whit Merrifield, Jersey and Auto, for the Royals. 12 out of 50. Cool Whit Merrifield. Going to the X line, who got the Royals uh, from a SIG series. That, that one he got from a SIG series break. All right, Pudge, Yvonne Rodriguez to 299. Miguel Cabrera to 299. Chris Davis to 259. Christian Yelich to 299. Let's get Yvonne Rodriguez into focus right here. There he is. All right, behind Nolan Ryan is a brave lefty righty, Ozzy Albies. 17 out of 36. Is that in the same game, no one's done that since. Wait, only the fifth player since World War II? Oh, as young as 21 to Homer from both sides to play the thing. Okay. Ozzy Albies, triple rally going to the Braves, Ron Shepard. It's a little bit of a stretch. There's Aaron Nola, 33 out of 75, Jersey and Auto. Really nice autograph. Good penmanship. Javier with the Phillies. There's Nolan Ryan. And there is 9 out of 9. San Fran Elite Buster Posey. That's a great one for the Giants. Even, even I like Buster Posey as a Dodger fan, Mark. Mark K with that. Dominic Smith, 7 out of 18. That is for Jason Trask and the Mets. Can we name the other? Ah, okay. Ozzy Albis, one, uh, only the fifth player under 21 since World War II to hit, from both, hit a homer from both sides of the plate. Who are the other four? Mickey Mantle. Chipper Jones. I don't know. Do you do you know the answer? Chris Bryant, 75. Roger Clemens, 199. Tony Gwynn, 259. And Barrios, to 199. That is good trivia. Does any, anyone want to venture a guess? If Ozzy Albius was only the fifth player since World War II, as young as 21, to homer from both sides of the plate in the same game. So thinking of under 21 switch hitters, since World War II, under 21 switch hitters who have hit from both sides of the plate in the same game. And we have a triple relic for the Rays. 23 out of 27. Blake Snell, Charlie Morton, and Tyler Glass now. And Cubbies, Kerry Wood. Nice. 69 out of 99. We got a bit of that Cubs pinstripe. And the autograph, Robert Myhill with the Cubbies. There's a great documentary I think I saw recently, or a feature on Fox Sports 1 or something like that. 
on Kerry Woods like 20 strikeout game we've got wow a three out of three Pete Alonzo triple relic and autograph piece of the bat two color jersey and that might be a piece of the base glove base maybe there's some infield dirt on there wow Jason Trask with the New York Mets. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. That's pretty strong right there. All right, we got Buster Posey to 27. That's for the Giants. That'll be for Mark K. All right, we have one, two, three, four, five boxes to go in triple threads. Then the four packs, or the four boxes from National Treasures right there. All right. Out of 99, Jose Abreu. Noah Syndergaard to one to uh, 259. And Eddie Rosario, 259. Miguel Cabrera to 299. So something Rex was thinking. You know, Tosh is the only licensed product that can't reproduce televised and reload with it. Um, no, I don't think they'll have a problem with live. Well, who? Tops or... Wow, nice. Are you talking Tops or Major League Baseball? There's J.D. Martinez. One of one. Triple Relic from the All-Star game. Boston Red Sox, Levi Johnson. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And there is, out of 50, Bren Lau. Nice Brandon Lau for the Rays, the X line. Oh, are you thinking Major League Baseball would have a... I don't think so. Twelve out of eighteen. Three games, five homers. Eddie Rosario, twelve out of eighteen. That will be for the twins, Scott, and the early bird spot. And more Giants, Buster Posey, eleven out of thirty six this time. Nolan Arenado, Javier Baez to 199, Aaron Gordon, and Jackie Robinson. Jose Ramirez has hit from both sides of the plate in the same game four times, Brian O. And Eddie Murray has done it in back to back games, but not when he was under 21. Uh no, Rex, I don't I don't think they I don't think they would. I think the 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 very nature of group breaks or the very nature of the hobby itself is to pull cards, show this off, and blah, 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 and the logo is just part of it. You know, so this is almost, you could almost consider trading cards as more of a promotional tool for Major League Baseball. If anything, you're like, some, like Levi would be like, oh, I got this nice Xander Bogarts card. Now maybe I want to watch more Boston Red Sox games. 
the idea of trading cards even from the beginning. Nice Patrick Corbin jersey and auto for the Nationals, who are still down 4-1, bottom of the seventh. The whole idea for trading cards back in the day was to insert these in tobacco packs to try to sell more tobacco. So trading cards are still is still almost like an advertising tool. Bill Dravogen with the uh, Nationals, by the way. Still almost an advertising tool for Major League Baseball, so I don't think they're going to crack down on this anytime soon. There's Dylan Cousins, 59 out of 99. Imagine like, the very nature of getting cards, too. You want to show these off, right? You want to put them on your Instagram, social media. So then you're asking people... The slippery slope legally would be like, oh, then then you then you can't show this on your Instagram anymore. That goes to the Phillies, Javier, and this is Cole Hamels for the Cubs at 36. And I don't think Tops would allow it too. Tops would be like, well, what's the point of producing these if people can't do these on online and do unboxing videos online, and if you can't show these off on social media, if you're gonna be that strict about the logo. Byron Buxton to 259, Cal Ripken Jr. to 299, and Frank Thomas to 299, and Johnny Bench to 299. Why wouldn't all card? Oh, why wouldn't baseball want all card companies have logos on them? Because Tops paid more. It's all money. Tops says if we pay you X amount of dollars then we're the only ones that can have the exclusive to the logos and the team names. And Major League Baseball said, okay. Five out of 27, leadoff, extra base hit. And I've got a feeling that sometimes Frankie Lindor goes to the tribe, Robert. I feel like sometimes it's easier for Major League Baseball to deal with just one entity as opposed to multiple entities. 92 out of 99. Miles Straw, and then baseball has had a relationship with Top since the 50s, so. Long standing relationship there. Miles Straw goes to the Astros. That will be for Scott Curry. Still leading, 4 1, bottom of the seventh. We've got Miles Mikolas, triple relic and autograph, 19 out of 75. And beyond Buster Posey is an Astro. Mikolas goes to Kenton and the Cardinals. And Alex Bregman goes to the Astros. That's out of 18. Nice. That'll be for Scott Curry. But yeah, like I was saying, Rex, they could they could deal with, but I, maybe they don't want to deal with two different companies. So instead of dealing with Panini and Tops, maybe they're thinking, oh, well, we just get X amount of money and save us the trouble from dealing with like four different companies with our with our logo. We have four times the amount of, you know, like making sure that they're representing our, our brand correctly and blah, 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 blah. All right. A one of one J.D. Martinez for the Red Sox. 2008. Nice patch. Nice triple relic. Nice autograph. And a train whistle for Levi Johnson. Nice. Levi, all aboard the Big Hit Express. And then we got Joey Lucchese, 29 out of 36, Relic at Aaron's with the Padres, getting him on the board. But yeah, that's my speculation, Rex, anyway. I mean, I don't know if there are many other reasons for that, but 13 out of 18 game winner, Austin Meadows, X-Line with the Rays. 
Doug Marsh saying well, Tops is exclusive to baseball until at least 2025. Yes, they've got it for a while. And then we've got Lourdes Guriel Jr. Jersey and autograph. 47 out of 99. That will be for the Blue Jays. Matt DeLeo, who won that spot in one of our SIG Series breaks. But I think for now, it just it does seem like we're in an era, um, we're in an era where, you know, Panini has a couple sports, Tops will focus on baseball, like Star Wars license and stuff like that. Upper Deck does does, does their hockey, does their things. Sorry, Brian, we sent Brian on a mission. Okay, so the the, the players under 21 since World War II that have hit a home run from both sides of the plate in the same game. Reyes, which, wait, which Reyes? Oh, Jose Reyes is the youngest at 20 years and 177 days. Ozzy Albies, Ruben Sierra. Yeah, that's a name I haven't thought about in a while. Eddie Murray and Johnny Lucadello. There you go. All right, Eddie Rosario to 99. John Smoltz to 259. Mariano Rivera to 50. Goldie to 75. Yeah, I've never heard of Johnny Lucadello, Gary. And I watch I watch a lot of baseball too. There's Jason Hayward, two out of twenty seven. That goes to Robert Myhill and the Cubs. We got Corey Dickerson jersey and autograph for the Pirates. Thirty six out of fifty. Pirates, Anthony P. But Luca Della was a Yankee in the 1940s, apparently. Uh, I remember listening to a lot of Yankees games in the 40s, Brian O. Don't remember hearing too much about any any Luca Della. There's Fielding Bible, Mookie Betts, to 36. I remember listening to him on the wireless. There's Mookie Betts right there. Another one for Levi. And behind Ben Intendi is Tommy Pham. Jersey and autograph for Tommy Pham. 58 out of 75. Old Cardinal, I think. Going to the X-Line, who has the Rays. All right, that's Triple Threads. National Treasures coming up. Clear away all these things here. All right, National Treasures coming up. Thought we might have to lock down the store, folks. All right, see you, Nick. Thank you. That's a fat box right there. Thanks, Brian O. Yeah, we'd like to think that we add a little layer of extra. Thirty-seven and you can watch anyone just unbox cards. All right, Corbin Burns, Milwaukee Brewers. I actually need some more uh, top loaders for this. Stand by. Let's pause really quick. Let's let's load up on the loaders. Package with up to 15 different camera views. 
All right, welcome back, folks. Back to the break. I've got all my top loaders set and ready to go. All right, so remember the first hit. Although I guess if you're watching the replay, there would just be an instantaneous cut. But anyway, it's Corbin Burns for the Brewers. And we got David Wright, 2 out of 10. Colossal Relic for the Metropolitan. That'll go to Jason Trask. We got Ryan Sandberg, 1 out of 10. Jersey and bat for Robert and the Cubbies. Going to a 180 here. Vlad Guerrero Jr. to 99 to 49 to 99, 42 out of 99, 92 out of 42 out of 9. I can't read anymore. That'll be for the Blue Jays. Matt DeLeo with the Bluebirds. And we've got Sean Reed Foley for the Blue Jays. Five out of 49. Two color patch and autograph. That'll be for Matt DeLeo. We've got 31 out of 99. Garrett Hampson. Triple relic and autograph. The X line with the Rockies. We've got Players Weekend, David Fletcher, 89 out of 99, Angels, Brian Croft with the Halos. And we've got Kevin Biggio, 93 out of 99. Nice one for the Blue Jays. Matt DeLeo. He's got a cool autograph, too. Let's see more of that Kevin Biggio autograph. Oh, and here's the book. The book is going to be Dual... Wow. Ronald Acuna Jr., Miguel Andujar, dual material signature. Two out of 99. Two color dual relic auto. Two color dual relic auto. One happy person, one sad person. We'll randomize that at the end. There's my knife. All right. Out of 25. Edwin Encarnacion for the Yankees. Game used material for that one. That will be for the Yankees, Bill Mosher. Miguel Cabrera, 9 out of 99. Tigers, Roger with the Tigers. Bill O, Brian O, should I do the rest of the, I could do the rest of the break in a 1940s newsreel voice. War! 7 out of 20. There's Juan Marichal. They always start newsreels with war. If you remember watching newsreels in the 40s, when movies were, were a dime. When people dressed up for the pictures. 1 out of 99, 81 out of 99, Jackie Robinson. Marichal goes to Mark C. and the Giants. And Chris Markley has my Dodgers. 
pretty cool right here. It's game used material for old Jackie Robinson. We got Luis Ortiz, 18 out of 99. Orioles. Logan on the board with the O's from the spot that Mr. X-Line got him. Nice guy, Josh X-Line. Or on the WWE circuit, it's X. That's, that's, it. that's what everyone does. When X-Line's going down the ramp, everyone's like X for the X-Line. Nine out of 99, Players Weekend, Brad Keller. Oh, there's another guy behind him. Corbin Burns is behind him. Royals, the X-Line, the Royals. Nineteen out of ninety-nine, Corbin Burns. For the Brew Crew, Jason Trask with the Brewers. Ooh, and an Eloy Jimenez, seventeen out of ninety-nine, beyond ready. Wow, that looks pretty cool right there. 17 out of 99, Eloy Jimenez, jersey and autograph. That goes to the X line with the White Sox. Nice break for Josh. Oh, and the book. It's going to be upside down. All right, we'll go. Oh, Junior. Wow. Fernando Tatis Jr., one of one. Woo! I didn't call Ed's name very much in this break, but I think just this once is okay. Wow. Maybe the, the light can catch the red ink autograph right there. That's pretty sweet. What, what, what is that? The number maybe? Patch right there? Man. That is nice. It's a one of one for Ed Aarons and the San Diego Padres. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. What a hit. It's the S and the D? The S of the D? There he is. My bad streak is over. Yeah, that's, that's a hell of a way to end the bad streak, man. Not for a lack of trying either, ladies and gentlemen. Ed Aarons is always in our breaks. Appreciate that. Nice hit. All right, we got a couple of fat boxes to end with here. Fat bottom boxes make the rockin' world go round. And we're lead off with another train whistle. We've got two. Oh, no, it was close. Not quite. Out of fives and under. Two out of seven, Eugenio Suarez for the Reds. That will be for Aaron Kreger. Close. Clint Frazier. Like Joe Frazier. It's 95 out of 99. Yankees. Bill Mosher. I don't know if maybe it kind of looked like it, right, Arthur? I thought so too, but no, that's the back of his foot. 
But I don't know, maybe some, I don't know what kind of mark is, is there. But I thought it was autographed, but over the window, but that's just part of the, his foot right there. I thought the same thing. There's Larry Walker, Retro Material, 78 out of 99. The X line with the Rockies. You got Shohei Otani, 10 out of 99. Angels, Brian Croft. Ken Griffey Jr., 7 out of 25. That is for the Mariners. Evans, the fire department coming for that Fernando Tatis. Ken Griffey Jr., Evan Levine with the Mariners. Another Eloy Jimenez, 22 out of 25 for the X-Line and the White Sox. It's pretty strong. We've got Dakota Hudson, 5 out of 25. Cardinals, that is for Kenton and the Redbirds. There's Brandon Lau. Two color patch and autograph. That's for the X line and the Rays. One of the spots that he won. There's Charlie Blackman. Jersey and autograph. Uh, 11 out of 25 for the X line and the Rockies. Man. And another book. What do we have? I think it goes this way. Cut signatures. It's Harmon Killebrew. Six out of 25 for Scott and the Twins. Oh, that's like this old Washington Senators, which turned into the Twins. Nice. Nice cut auto for Scott Curry. That was an early bird spot, too. And the final box of our three-case triple crown mixer, baseball mixer. I think it's been pretty strong. I think there's going to be another version of this tomorrow, so keep an eye out for it on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Let's see what we got to close this break out. A lot of extra hits or a monster book or both. Looks like a, looks like a big book right here. All right, three out of six, Marcel Ozuna, Cardinals for Kenton. Got Steve Garvey, 94 out of 99. Dual Relic, a little Dodger Joe Mojo for Chris Markley. One out of five, Albert Pujols, Triple Relic. Nice one for Brian Croft. Got randomized the Halos. And. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Aaron Judge, 65 out of 99. I like all the relics they have in here. The Redemption, Jake Bowers for the Cleveland Indians. That'll be for Robert Myhill. Thank you. 
And we have Kyle Wright. Three color patch and autograph. 15 out of 99. Braves, Ron Shepard. Another thick card right here. Ramon Laureano. 80 out of 99. Oakland A's. Peter with the A's. Then we've got from Peter to Pete Alonzo, four out of 99, triple relic and autograph. Jason Trask with the Mets. And the book. What do we got here? Sixteen player materials. One happy person, 15 sad people. A little bit of a, a dent right there in the card, just FYI. Notice that coming out of the box. Numbered 14 out of 25. Let's see what we got here. Wow. A lot of names on here. A lot of guys on here. Mike Trout, George Springer, Tommy Pham, Lorenzo Kane. And on this side, Anthony Rizzo, Jose Abreu, Freddie Freeman, Reese Hoskins. Justin Verlander, Max Scherzer, Jacob deGrom, Chris Sale. Chris Bryant, Nolan Arenado, Justin Turner, and Alex Bregman. That is nice. So we've got a couple randomizers to end this break. Let's get everything set up. All right. The first one. ATL and the New York Yankees. The second one, let's close up the book really quick. Second one, all those teams right there. Los Angeles Angels. Anthony Rizzo, Chicago. George Springer, Houston. Jose Abreu, Chicago White Sox. Tampa Bay Rays. Tommy Pham, Atlanta. Freddie Freeman. Lorenzo Kane. Milwaukee, Reese Hoskins, Philadelphia. So Angels, Cubs, CHC, Angels, Cubs, Houston, CHW, Tampa Bay, Rays, ATL, Milwaukee, Philadelphia. Then the other side was Verlander, Chris Bryant, Max Scherzer, Nolan Arenado, Jacob deGrom, Justin Turner, Los Angeles Dodgers, Chris Sale, and Alex Bregman. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. All right. One dice roll. Yeah, I don't know what the relationship is to all these guys. Just rad play. Yeah, just good ball players on here. Just like, hey, here's some cool ball players we're going to collect into a book. All right. Let's roll it and randomize it five and a four nine times. The uh, dual relic, dual auto coming up first. The Acuna Jr. and the Miguel Andujar. Let's take another look at that one. That looked really nice too. Two out of 99. There you go. All right, so that's between the Yankees, uh, the Braves on the left side, Ron Shepard and the Yankees, Bill Mosher on the right side. Once again, five and a four nine times. Team on top gets it, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, team on top, Yankees. That'll be for Bill Mosher and the New York Yankees. So there you go. You can thank Miguel Andujar for that. 
and you'll get the Acuna Jr. as well. Two out of 99 on that one. That is nice. All right, and now time to make one person happy and a bunch of other people sad. After five and four, nine times, team on top gets it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, the Washington Nationals get it. That's for Bill D. So two different Bills winning the randomizers. There you go. So congrats to the Bills. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was, I think that's it for the randomizers. What a break. What a break. Jaspie's Triple Crown Baseball Mixer here on Friday the 25th. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for breaking with us. And we'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com. This is Joe. We'll see you next time.